Okay, today on Outdoors My Way, we're headed up to check out some uh, forest service roads looking for good campsites. I'm going to camp out for tonight and try my truck cab set up one more time before we head cross country with it. Uh, just make sure I got everything all lined out. And I'm also looking for a campsite to bring my son to. Something new that he had, where he hadn't been. So when he comes back this summer, I'm hoping to have a new place to take him camping. Uh, Some place he hadn't ever been before. So I'm out exploring these forest service roads and I'm gonna find something. Uh, I'm also going to do some trout fishing tomorrow, but for today, we're looking for campsites. Let's go explore a forest road. What do you say? Hey, YouTube. Didn't drive up this road very far before I found this. Nice little campsite. It's got a place there, a place over there where I could park. Another one across the road. One good thing about these old Forest Service roads, you can usually find good campsites various places. Looks like there's a trail through here. Some sort of trail going up across. A nice little creek. Fire ring already established. Lots of skeeters. But I think I'm gonna ride on up the road just to see what else I can find. Uh, maybe something more interesting higher up. Another nice little camp spot, right? Just right here beside the road. I ain't crazy about it being right beside the road, but got a pretty little creek down here. Makes me wonder if there's any brook trout in that creek. Very well possibly could be. for the trees right here would be an awesome vista great view from up here but there's no way you can see it through this camera but uh, at least I'm getting high enough to maybe find a campsite that has a nice view but uh, I'm still looking ridge line and there was no views uh, one thing about here in the Appalachians is everything's covered with trees and it blocks a lot of the views, but still go search around. Uh, it's just fun to get out and explore new roads and uh, figure out where they go and what kind of campsites they have. But this is, this is pretty typical of the roads through the mountains around here. Uh, just kind of high clearance road but got plenty of campsites right off the road but a lot of the views are just blocked by trees so I'm going to keep searching see if I can find one somewhere else <laughs> Okay, I 
did not find the type of campsite I'm looking for and I'm already back to uh, another paved road but I know I'm not far from a campsite I stayed at a couple videos ago had a gorgeous view so I believe I, uh, I'm gonna head up there at six o'clock tonight or six o'clock right now so I'm gonna head up there that way I can see a nice beautiful sunset and have a beautiful view for the evening. I'm at where I'm going to camp at tonight. I didn't uh, plan on coming back up here again. But it's the best view around. And I had hoped to find one on top of another mountain. But it uh, didn't work out for me. You know, here in the Appalachians, you got all these hardwood forests. And sometimes it's hard to find a good view. Uh... And I'm going to keep searching these forest service roads, but well, I enjoyed uh, exploring a new road and uh, driving through the woods, but I believe this is where I'm going to camp for tonight. You just can't beat that view. All right, it's dinner time. I'm going to make me something to eat. I'm getting a little hungry. So tonight's dinner is ramen noodles with a little bit of roast beef in them. If y'all watch my videos, y'all know I don't get crazy when I'm out camping as far as cooking goes. Uh, I'd rather sit back and enjoy the view than to spend my time cleaning up a big mess from a big meal. See if this little electronic lighter will set it up without burning me. Looks delicious, doesn't it? I doubt this GoPro can catch the sky this morning. It's actually beautiful sunrise. Which I guess they're all beautiful, as long as you get to see them. Look at that. You know, the skies were nice and clear last night. Got to see plenty of stars from up here. I tell you, I love being out in these mountains. I'm trying to get me a little bit of coffee ready to go this morning. Got my water heating up. probably going to be a little bit dark but anyway I do have my coffee Just getting ready hmm. look at that sky this morning man beautiful but uh, I'm fixing to head down off the mountain and go see if the trout fishing it's better than the campsite hunting. Yeah. Didn't find any new campsites, but hopefully I can catch some trout this morning. Uh, blue ribbon trout stream right down the road here, so we'll go down here and see if I can catch anything. A couple little deer there. this morning. Hi 
right guys I got my seven and a half foot three weight today i'm gonna start off with the terminator with the prints down below it i'm gonna try to start off with some tight lining i don't know if that'll work but it should water looks great this morning i wanted to come out and hit this creek before heading out west it will be kind of neat to compare a east coast blue ribbon trout stream and a montana blue ribbon trout stream i think it's going to be uh curious to see how they compare there's one oh, that didn't take long oh he popped off There's one. All right. Nice, pretty little bow. little one to start the day that first one i hooked was a little bit better oh, it feels like a decent fish there we go Oh, good little rainbow. All right. Beautiful little fish. Stand back in there. Ooh. There's one. Just had to get a little bit deeper. you too. Mm. Get my, I don't want to get my butt wet. Mm. Another pretty little rainbow this morning. I've been hooking several but just ain't landing them. Okay. Another one. Ooh All right. Another one of them pretty little rainbows. Let's get him back. That little dude attacked it. That's got to be a brown. And that's what it is. Look at that little brown. Played the catch some one. Wish it was a little bit bigger. But man, look at the red on that tip. Tip of that fin. That's beautiful. Beautiful red dot. Man, that's a good looking fish. Grow up, buddy. Become big. Nice. This is a good fish. I bet this came down from the stocked water. Oh, 
Boy, who's fighting? Ah, got him. Yeah, it's a stocked fish. I kind of thought so. Well, it's a good fish. But he is a stalker. You can tell by his fins and stuff. He's been stalked in, come down from the stock water. Which is right up above here. But he was fun and exciting nonetheless. I think it's a good way to end my fishing today with that sucker right there. <laughs> He's bigger. There you go, buddy. And he's gone. Well, folks, I'm back at the truck. After that last, after that stock fish, I decided just to call it a day and head to the house. I hope you enjoyed this video. Just a quick overnighter out in the mountains. A little bit of camping, a little bit of fishing. It was a good trip. If you made it this far in the video, how about giving me a like and subscribe and come back in the future for more outdoor videos.